Hey guys, welcome back. So today I'm going to share with you a Michaels haul that I did a, I think it was a couple weeks ago. Um, so this was when the fall items and the Halloween items were still sitting at like 50, 60%. Now the Halloween items, I just went in there yesterday, I think. Now the Halloween items are sitting at 80% off and they, uh, no, yes. So they're sitting at 80% off and the, um, they actually have an 80% off clearance uh, uh, area. So anyway, so the haul that I'm going to go over with you today, I actually went in because this is when they had the Recollections paper pads, the basic eight and a half by 11 paper pads for four for 10. No, it was five for 10. So they were $2 a piece. So if I can find my receipt, um, then I will try to point out if it was two fifty a pack or if it was two dollars a pack. I'm pretty sure it was two dollars a pack though. So anyway, I found these. Um, these are not like any of the other floral that I have to go with my fall decor, and there was only one. Like I only saw one in any of the floral area. So I went ahead, I did price check it. Um, apparently there's price checkers in Michael's or at least in mine and some others as well. Um, Amanda LAC is the one that mentioned it to me and she was just like, hey, just double check the prices before you go up to the register. That way you're not surprised, blah, blah, blah. And so I was like, well, where the heck? I actually spent like an hour looking for this thing and it was kind of, it was kind of humorous. Anyway, finally I got up to the register and I asked the, the cashier and she pointed me in the right direction. And after being in the stores a few times, I actually found a second one. So just check around for your price scanners uh, throughout the store. And if you can't find one, ask a cashier or any associate. And if they have them in the store, they will point you in the right direction. Um, so anyway, I thought these were really pretty. Um, these were a, I believe these were 50% off and they don't have a lot of fallout, but they do shed a tiny bit. Um, these were $1.50. I went ahead and got these because I don't have a ton of Christmas stuff, but I have a little bit. Um, so I do a lot of um, like just holiday decorating and winter decorating. Um, so this, these are name tags. They're name plates uh, for place settings, but I thought they were really cool because you can use them as cards. Like if you put them in albums or if you put them inside another card that you're already making, it could be a cute little embellishment to add to it. So that's why I got these. These were on clearance for $1.40. Um, I got these. I uh, used my 50% off coupon on this and I got this for $1.50. There's a teal color, a blue, a a medium colored blue, a light blue, and a white, and there's also this cute little purple. There's only two in here that are purple, but oh, that's cute. Um, I got these also for a dollar fifty. They're just uh, different gourds. They, uh, from what they feel like, they are styrofoam, so um, I have to be very careful not to squish them. But I thought those were super cute. Um. These I was like through the moon for because I was actually able to find various packs um, and they didn't have hardly any left. Like they didn't, this was the only one that they had of this one left. And there's leaves, there's acorns, there's little pumpkins. Um, there is, uh, oh, what's, what is that? I almost want to open it, but I don't because it's not resealable. Oh, what is it? It looks like a dragon, but I know it's not a dragon. Um, it is a squirrel. I had to get it in the right position because it wasn't showing up. It's this little thing right here. I had it upside down, so I couldn't see what it was. Um... So it looked very strange to me. I was like, what the heck is that thing? But I finally put it in the right position. So anyway, this was the only pack that they had left. And this was also 50% off. So I got this, I got all three of these for $2.50 a piece. Um, and honestly, 
I don't think that that's a bad price. Um, they're like a really hard plastic, if not a uh, glass. You know those little rocks that you can find at the Dollar Tree, the little round pebbles? They're in here too. And I think the, all of the little ornaments in here are made out of the same material, whatever material that is. Um, this one is just various colors of the, the pebbles, but it also has an owl. You see that? So they have owl, they have big owls, then they have tiny owls, and the, this was just super adorable. I think they only had like one or two of these left, and they only had like one or two of these left as well. This one I grabbed the last one, and one of these, I forget which one, I left two, and the other one I left one. And I only got one of each, but yeah. So there is pumpkins in here, various colors, various sizes, various shapes. There's acorns. Um, this one's got like a really light orangey color, a darker orangey color, and like a medium orangey color. And then the green. So I, I love these. I saw these and I was like, ah! It was awesome. So I just screamed at you guys. So um, there is that. I also found some doilies. These were 99 cents a piece. All of this stuff right here in this pile was 99 cents. So there, uh, there's yellow doilies, there's 12 in here. Uh, th these are just envelopes. There's no cards, they're just envelopes. Um, so I'm gonna have to figure out, like, I'm gonna have to pre-cut some cards to go in these specific envelopes. Um, because I have a tendency of making cards that don't fit standard envelopes. Anyway, there's these 12 pieces. I got one of each color they had. Um, this one is kind of a neat little story with that. So I, my, so I show my husband everything that I buy. And I showed him this. And he looked at me like I was crazy. Um, and he's like, can't you make that? I was like, well, yeah. He's like, then why'd you buy it? It's like, so I can reference it to make it. He's like, oh, okay. So I bought this um, to reference so I can make more. Because it's really pretty. They had different colors. And I was thinking that if I can make this large enough, then I can make like a little mat to go underneath my centerpiece for my table. Um, and it... It does take me a minute to do crochet. It's not something that I can do really fast. Something like this, if I already know how to do it, I could probably do it in an hour. But, um, and it does look simple enough. It's just a matter of chains and double crochets. So it, it does look simple enough. So anyway, that's why I bought that. But yeah, he was a little confused when he saw it because he was just like, um, don't you know how to make those? Like, well, I kind of bought it for the pattern, if that makes sense. And another doily. Um, so these were up at the register and, well, not that. These were up at the register and I, these were on sale. Uh, I don't remember how much. Um, I want to say they were 50 cents a piece and I got eight bags in each pack. So I didn't necessarily get them for what they said on the bags, but for the color because they are fall and I can, again, I've been into this whole album kick lately. I can create albums with these. So, and there's the last album that I'm working on right now. I used creating eight bags. And so I was just like, well, that's perfect because there's eight bags in each pack. So I have this one that's green. It says, be kind to yourself. Be happy, be kind, be brave, be you. I like that, be you easier to be you than someone else so you make me happy so this is a brown an orange and a green um, I think I got another green I did nope I didn't I lied so that's it for that and these are some more envelopes I got the green the pink and the pink and these are what I was talking about at the beginning of the video where I said um, they were five for ten 
So I got this citrus cardstock pack paper. Um, there's 50 sheets in here, and they're various yellow and yellows and oranges. I tried to only get the colors. Like there's a lot of these that I don't have, but I definitely didn't want to just be like, okay, well I don't have that, so let me get it. Um, because I have a ton of paper. So I didn't want to get something that I knew I wasn't going to use right now. You know what I mean? So I just wanted to stick with the fall type colors. So this one again has um, various oranges and it's got a brown in there. The blue kind of threw me through a loop on that one, but you know, it's there. Uh, it's called Canyon, which I guess is why the blue is there, but I don't know. I'd have to do my magic to work that blue into fall. Um, so I got a gray, a gray cardstock. I only got the one gray. And this one's Spice Market. This is actually the second pack of Spice Market that I'm, I'm buying. Uh, the first pack I bought like two or three months ago. But um, I really like these colors. I like the color combinations. Really pretty. So I got that. And uh, these... She's probably like waiting for me to give her. Um, these were all 50 cents a piece. So I haven't opened them, so I can't really go through them. Uh, this one is the Avengers. It's got the Hulk, Iron Man, Captain America, Thor. I got two of these because this is one of her favorite characters is Anna, actually. Um... So she loves Anna, and so I wanted to see. That's the stickers. They're not really Halloweeny, but they have they have Halloween's stuff on them. Um, I might open this one just show, to show you what I'm talking about. So, like this page here, it does have Halloween stuff on it, like the trick or treat pumpkin. Um, and the Jacqueline or the pumpkins down here, but like this sticker right here, it's just a picture of Anna, and this picture is just a picture of Elsa, and then Anna and Elsa together. And I mean, heck, these are snowflakes. So, I mean, I don't know. It just it doesn't. The actual character stickers don't look very Halloweeny to me, and it's just with these. Um, the other cartoon stickers they were more Halloweeny, so. Um, I just got these. So I got these for Sid. Um, these, I think Sid's probably going to end up taking. Porter is not very interested in stickers, but they were there. So I figured, hey, why not? So I got the Avengers, um, Spider-Man, and the Ninja Turtles. Love the Ninja Turtles. They're awesome. So these are for Sid. Here, Ben. And these I ended up using my 50% off coupon with as well because at the time I have so very little Hall or Halloween. Gosh, I have so much Halloween stuff. I have so little Christmas stuff. So um, I did get this pack of stickers. I actually thought they were really cute. And I like the fact that it says Happy Holidays um, because there's so many people in this world that celebrate a different holiday during the winter um, not just Christmas do you know what I mean so I love the fact that it says happy holidays um, so I got that uh, I did get this little paper pad I've been trying to stay away from the 12 by 12s it doesn't always work because I'm a little obsessed but I've been trying and you know failing miserably but hey I got a six by six this time. Um, so I'm just opening this up right now so I could flip through this like super fast for you guys. Um, it, and I say super fast because there's 180 pages in here. So this is called uh, Paper Pad. All right. Yeah, it's called Paper Pad by Recollections. Anyway, um, this is more... Um, of the darker browns and creams. I really like these actually. The cutouts. Those are just too cute to me. I love that. Um, so. Love that. I just. I flipped through here. And I flipped through here already. And. Um, 
I really, really like these. Can you put this over here? They're getting stuck because the sticky stuck to the side of the paper here. I like that one just because it's got the lines. It says, make the rest of your life the best of your life. And that is it. Okay, so that's that. Um, okay, this was actually kind of cool because I got this because you know they're acorns, or not acorns, they're pine cones and they're pretty. And I got it for 50% off. I got home and I was like, what does that smell? And I started digging through that bag and I picked it up and I was like, oh, they smell. And it's like, it's a cinnamony color, art color, smell. It's like, um, you know when you make apple cider, like homemade apple cider? That's what it smells like. And I don't mean like apple cider, you buy it in a jug and open it up because that doesn't really have any smell. I also got these for half off. Um, this one is a fall, autumn, Thanksgiving theme, and this one's just brown. Um... Oh, and I found my receipt. Okay, so they were $2. So they were five for, um, five for 10. So it was the craft, the VP eight and a half by 11 gray KR, blah, 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 number $2, one at $2. And I will try to remember to zoom in during the edit phase so you guys can see that. Um, so that is the receipt. Um, I also ended up getting a couple other things. Um, I got these that were Halloween, but if you can notice, they're completely blank. Like there's nothing on them. It's just a pick. It's just a, like a chipboard piece of a pumpkin. So I could definitely, um, change this to a fall pumpkin versus a jack-o'-lantern pumpkin. Um, and I got a bunch of, uh, ribbons, if you will, even though they're not ribbons. Uh, this one is, this one does have a wire on both sides and it is a, it's more of a cloth, but it is a ribbon. And I got this one. And like I said, all of these were also 50% off. I got some burlap, uh, a red, uh, my color schemes have like completely disappeared on me. Another one that's orange and I have some twine. I got the green, orange, and brown. Again, all of these were 50% off and this is 120 feet of twine. That's a lot of twine. And what I really like about these is that they are solid. They're not decorative. They're just solid colors. And I can use these throughout the entire year. And that's what I really, really like about um, getting things that are on sale or on clearance for specific holidays or specific seasons. Um, because the packaging might say, you know, Thanksgiving. Or the packaging might say, <clears throat> excuse me, Halloween. Like for instance, these pumpkins. These pumpkins are clear as day in a Halloween package. But they're pumpkins. I can use them like all throughout this entire season, not just for Halloween. So I actually did a lot of the uh, Halloween stuff like that when it went on clearance. Um, or not when it went on clearance, but when it started going on sale, I started picking up the items that I could use um, throughout the year, like the silver and gold and this, that, and another, you know? So um, all I'm doing is I'm moving this stuff out of the way for him. So I got this, I picked this up at the register, the $1.50 spot. It was $1.50, but I went ahead and got it. Um, I do like the colors a lot, and I don't really have any not Halloween straws. Actually, this is only the second pack of straws I have. Um, so I also got these and 
Wayne kind of looked at me. He's like, why'd you buy more stamps? Um, and more Halloween stamps for that matter. But I actually don't have a lot of Halloween stamps. I think I have like two sets, two or three sets that are Halloween. Um, but anyway, these were regular priced at $2.99 a piece. So I was just like, huh? I was a little confused. Uh, they were not part of the 50 off sale. Um, and the cashier was, she was just going to be like, you know, I'll give you the 50% off because it, it is Halloween stuff. And I was like, no, 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 it's fine. Um, it, it's three bucks. I'm not that worried about it. So, um, I got both of these. Um, and the last couple items I got, I'm not going to show you all four packs. They're exactly the same. Um, this one's cut and fall out from everything else. So I got four packs of the Craft 65 pound weight cardstock uh, paper from Recollections because again it was four for ten, or it was actually five for ten. But I thought for some reason it was four for ten, so I got increments of four instead of five. But um, anyway, um, I got four of those, and I also got these pencils. Uh, they were, oh, this was the Target dollar spot that I got these at. I was like, wait a minute, that's not Michael's. That's the Target dollar spot. Um, I got, I did go to Target and I got literally like one or two things. So yeah, adding that into here. Anyway, they were really cool. They've got gold on one side. They're not sharpened at all. Um, so I recently found an idea for um, like small gifts for the include pencils and I'm going to kind of give my go at that and see what happens. So anyway, that's it for this haul video and I hope you guys enjoyed it and um, thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time. Bye guys.